What in the world? Donkey, Donkey Job, Job Projects! Hey y'all. So guess what? Today, I have crazy hair again. <laughs> and uh, I'm doing a little research here. Day 89 of 100 Days of Making Comics. Um, and I've been writing, working, but also kind of writing because I have free time with my mind so I can kind of write and dictate things as I go. Um, so I've gotten in about uh, probably three hours of writing. Started this morning when I woke up um, and I've been doing some throughout the day. And um, <clears throat> So I'm writing for the Hitchhiker story, um, which is very possibly, hopefully, going to work out to be a collaboration project, which is I'm really excited about. Me being the primary writer and possibly somebody else being the primary artist, which I think is kind of awesome. Yeah. Um, so anyways, and we're going to probably try to... Um, I mean, I guess I could talk about it. It's my buddy. You know what? I'm not going to talk about it until I get permission. So, um, uh, yeah, so I'm writing for The Hitchhiker, and um, I'm excited. I'm going to try to submit it to uh, Alterna Comics. And it's fun kind of building out the world of it. Um, I'm having a hard time figuring out how to physically, I don't know if it's even physical, but like write it out. Like I could obviously just write it out in a document, but I'm using Trello and Trello has like all these cards and all these like little ways of organizing things. So I'm trying to like use that as a writing tool, but I feel like I'm making it more complicated than it has to be, so I don't want to do that. I just want to get things done, you know. So I don't know. That's a weird thing, but anyways, um, so I got Seti, and and he comes from a family. Um, he comes from a family. I don't know if I want to get into it too much, but basically he works on a farm. He start, he comes from a family who has a farm um, on the planet Dorsey. Um, and, you know, one of the things he, he deals with is um, these animals called, um, what are they called? Skirfuls? <laughs> What did I name them? Let me see. Let me see. Skirfuls doesn't sound right, but it might be. Uh, where are we? Where are we? It is Skirfuls. <laughs> Skirfuls. Um, and basically, the way I envision these Skirfuls is they're kind of like ostriches, but they're going to look weird and different, you know. They're gonna, but they're kind of the idea of big, huge bird-like animals that don't really fly, but they are useful. Um, you know, you can probably, I don't know, maybe you can milk them. You can use their feathers. You can eat them, <laughs> probably. I don't know. I haven't figured all that out yet. But, and you could eat their eggs probably. Maybe, maybe not milk. Maybe eat their eggs, obviously, because that's what you know birds do you I, you know what I mean so anyways um skirfuls so um you know I'm looking up skirfuls because I I was like okay I wrote something where they bring the skirfuls into roost or whatever and I'm like what does it, that even mean like I don't even know what roost means <laughs> I just hear the phrase you know coming home to roost I know it has to do with like chickens so I'm like, all right, let me figure out what roost means. And it meant 
you know, basically them coming home and this is where they rest and relax for the day. Wherever that is, and there's more to it. But um, then I'm finding out, like, all this stuff about chickens and, like, how they work together and probably more than I need to know. Um, because, to be honest, like, you know, this, this story is called The Hitchhiker. So he's not going to necessarily be, you know around his family all that much most likely you know um so i don't really need to know that much about these skirfles <laughs> but um you know i just wanted to at least know what roost meant so i got a little carried away looking into because it's interesting how chickens work in the pecking order and stuff like that so i started like reading this whole article or whatever but i don't know who knows maybe it'll come into play some at some point but anyways, it's just the funny, the things you research, you know, the other day I looked up VFW just for a comment I was writing, <laughs> um, and just like, you look up these like little things, I'm always looking up words, like just to see what the spelling is and stuff, so I don't know, it's fun, it's, it's interesting, it's cool to have the basis of knowledge at your at, that you can pull up at your whim <laughs> at any point in time um aka the internet so yeah i'm just excited that i'm getting a lot of writing done today and um you know i really want to knock out basically a three issue script um or at least an outline a three issue outline that is pretty a pretty good outline where i know where it's going um, and then I want to write out, you know, the first, uh, five to eight pages, um, in detail in script form so that, um, we can start working on the art of it and then we can get, you know, a, um, five to eight page, probably five page plus a, um, cover art, a, um, I always forget the word for it. <laughs> um a pitch <laughs> for alterna comics so who knows maybe we'll even pitch it to other places but i really am excited about alterna so we'll see but yeah i'm excited we're working on uh seti's adventure seti being the main character with the like little snorkels on his head that i did for the hitchhiker for uh life in space anthology which will be shipping somewhat soon <laughs> It's uh, kind of it's off to the printers, but there's been some hiccups that we have no control over, unfortunately. But it's still going to work out and come out pretty soon. <laughs> so don't you fear. Anyways, that's about it. Just wanted to talk about chickens. <laughs> and uh, hopefully I'll get to play around with some art today. Probably won't, though. Um, this is about the last amount of free time I have on my lunch and then you know I will probably get some more writing done though so hope you guys are having an awesome Monday that's about it I'll talk to you later peace out